Okay guys, join me in making some soft boiled shoyu eggs. For this recipe, you will need the following ingredients. The first thing you want to do is make sure you bring your eggs to room temperature. Leave them out of the refrigerator for about an hour before we start the process. Ginger will be one of the ingredients in the marinade. You're just going to need a pinky size and we're going to just cut them into strips. Next, you will need two good sized cloves of garlic. You can either mince them or use a garlic crusher, which I'm going to use, and I'm going to crush it directly into the pot when I start to make the marinade. In a small pot, add 1 fourth cup of sugar, a half cup of water, half cup of shoyu, a fourth cup of mirin, your sliced ginger, your two cloves of crushed garlic, and last, a handful of green onions. Set the temperature to medium-high and let it come to a boil. Once it's boiling, turn off and remove from heat and let it cool off completely. Now we're going to boil the eggs. It's very important to have your water already boiling before you add your room temperature eggs. Gently place your eggs in the water and set your timer for 6 minutes. Time, prepare an ice bath for your eggs. We want to put the eggs directly into this ice bath to stop the cooking. Once your eggs have chilled completely, gently remove the shell off of all the eggs. And because we've made soft boiled eggs, you'll notice how soft it is. And you want to be very careful not to break the egg before we're going to add it to the marinade. Next, you're going to put your eggs into a container and try to find a container that's deep enough so that your marinade can cover most of your egg, if not all. Cover it up and then you're going to put it in the fridge and let it marinate for a minimum of 24 hours. Just like that, overnight, your eggs are ready to be eaten. When you cut your egg in half, you should have a jelly-like center. But if you like it more runny, you can shorten the cook time. This is a great snack to eat alone, but even better in a bowl of ramen. Come back tomorrow to check out my video on my ramen recipe.